yesterday I saw a couple of videos online, uh, obviously on YouTube, covering uh, potential hidden features of the F20 series. I noticed they were both, uh, both of the videos were related to pre-LCI versions of the F20. So I thought I would uh, check and see if we have the same hidden features on the uh, uh, LCI version. So one of them, of course, is the hidden menu. So uh, we'll start up, put some power, and then give it a second to boot up and then we'll keep this pressed and see if any hidden menu comes up. Yeah, we'll keep it pressed a bit more. There you go. We have the same hidden menu. So to scroll through it, just press the button and keep pressing it to scroll through the available options and then to select an actual option so everybody else did the system test I guess I'll do the same keep the button pressed and then start system test I guess one click there you go So if I press it once, it probably will do the test again, so I'll keep it pressed. There we go, we went back. So, uh, unlock, probably unlocks more features of this, uh, of this, uh, menu. So, I'll do what the other guys did. Yep, and you should put in your, the, the sum of the last five numbers of your VIN. So, in my case, it is 25. Well, there you go. Every time you press it, it goes up by one. And then to confirm it, I'll keep pressed. Awesome. So, you can see that after unlock, there's a few more features now. A few more options. Tank. Temperature. Alright. No. Outside temperature, raw data, coolant temperature, oil temperature. Hmm. I haven't actually driven the car in uh, more than 12 hours, and yet the oil temperature is higher than, than the ambient temperature and higher than the coolant temperature. Whatever that means. Oh, it probably has been pre warmed when I came into the car. That's probably the explanation. Alright, so to go back, I guess I keep it pressed. There we go. And I don't actually know what most of these are. Identification will give me the VIN number. System test we did before. Start roller. Well, I don't know. I don't know what this is. Initialize BC, comma range. Test end, I guess, is the way to exit this menu. Unlock we already did. Tank. Oh, tank left, 130 ohms. These are resistance values. Tank right. Okay. Display value 43. Tank phase. No wonder these are hidden options. Some of them are, well, beyond my comprehension anyway. So if, uh, if you guys know what some of these are, BC0. If you guys know what some of these are, please uh, let me know in the comments below. Uh, and then to exit this, I guess we'll uh, go to end test. There we go. Keep that pressed. End test. Yes. Yep. And we're up. Okay, it's been reported that there's a hidden secondary 12 volt socket under the glove box. So, checking mine. I don't see it. Uh, there's the vents and there's the attachment fasteners. But I think they're a hole. It's somewhat difficult to find it from this angle. Uh, here at the front, but I think it's just the hole. I don't think there's anything in there. There's no no attachment hardware. So 
yeah it's probably it's probably here on some of the other cars but it's definitely not here for me anyway on the trunk on the right hand side 